Hey everyone, I'm Laura. Today I'm going to show you how to apply transitions in DaVinci Resolve. So, going to get right to it. I have a whole bunch of different videos already here. And you're going to go to your toolbox in the bottom left corner and find the transition that you're looking to add to your video. So I'm going to go with the non-additive dissolve, but what I do like is you can hover over the words and it's going to show you what the transition will look like so you can get an idea of which one you may want to add. So you want to select your clip, have it selected here, and you can right click your transition, add to selected edit, edit points and clips. So from here, it just adds it to the end of the one that you had selected. I'm going to undo that real quick. If you have two or more selected at the same time, same thing. Right click, add to selected endpoints and clips. Um, what I like is it's going to kind of merge them together and make it a more seamless transition. You'll see what I'm talking about in a second. Um, unfortunately, it does ask you if you want to trim the clip because for some reason it doesn't exactly mesh uh, exactly where it has lined up. If you trim the clip, it is literally a matter of seconds of the whole video that you're going to lose. Um, it's not a big deal. So, um, I'll just show you what this looks like now. It, trans it transitioned them very seamlessly. Now, I only had two selected. So, the very last one only has the, the transition added to the end of it and not to the next one. So, it's a little bit black before it goes into the next video, which I don't like and I didn't want that. So, we're going to undo that. And instead, what we will do is that bottom is we're gonna select everything. Now you could zoom out and just click and drag to select everything. I'd rather do a control A, just select everything for the hell of it, why the hell not? And these are video transitions, so the only thing it's gonna apply the transition to is something in the video tab. So yeah, sure, it's gonna add it to my little watermark. I don't really care about that. Um, but same thing, right click it, Add to select edit points and yada yada. Trim clips. Okay, look how little of the video is actually going to change down here when I do trim the clip. It's really not that much. Okay, so it added to every single one in a matter of seconds. You don't have to go through and do this every single time, which would be obnoxious. Anywho, that's it. Super duper easy. Hopefully that helped you out. If you got value out of this, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe, follow along, and we'll see you next time for more tips and tricks how to grow your YouTube and just get better at all this stuff. I'll see you guys in the next video.